Why is film photography so popular right now? You not only see it now amongst photographers growing, but you also see it in just mainstream media. So let's kind of just deep dive why film is so popular right now. All right, I did some quick research and put together a list of some of the reasons why I think it is getting so popular right now. All right, the first reason I think is because celebrities have been caught. That sounds weird. In recent years, we're seeing more celebrities shoot film like Kendall Jenner, Devin Booker, Emma Chamberlain. And a lot of these celebrities have been seen in public or photos have been taken of them, which is very meta, of them using film cameras. Uh, for example, the Context T2, when Devin Booker and Kendall Jenner um, were seen using these cameras the price of those cameras skyrocketed. So I think that's a large reason as to why it has gotten so popular, especially among people who are like under 30 years old. Uh, yeah, it's just seeing celebrities shoot these film cameras. All right, I think the second reason why it's getting popular is because analog or things that are analog or vintage are making a comeback. In fact, I feel like this has been the trend for a few years now, but even the way that people dress right now are very reminiscent of what I saw growing up in like the 90s or early 2000s. Vinyl records have been very popular for years and years now. And I think that a lot of like the nostalgia around our childhood or things of the past, especially in a world that we live in right now that's moving so quickly, I think there's an affinity towards things that are again nostalgic of our childhood, of things that were maybe slower paced. And I think film photography is very much a part of that because prior to the digital photography age really exploding and being commonplace, not only in cameras like SLR, DSLRs, but also in our phones now, I think our human nature also craves in a world that's so fast to slow down a little bit. The last reason is because we live in a world that's moving so quickly and it's so visible online there's this deep desire for authenticity. I think even within like the photography community in general, like it's sharpness, color science have been these things that we've cared about so much for so long. But I think what's lost in that sometimes is storytelling and composition and film photography very much forces you to focus on those things because it's not something that's quick. It's not something that's fast. In many ways, it forces you to be very intentional and slow down. And so I think that in a world, again, that has been, it feels like progressing so quickly over the past few years, especially with social media, I think when we're seeking for authenticity, film photography is such a great medium to convey that. I would also love to ask my friends why they shoot film. And so I'm gonna ask them why they shoot film photography. Mike, just in like one sentence, share with me why you shoot film. Yeah, I love shooting film because it takes me away from work and allows me to document my life in a way that just feels organic and fun. Mr. Steven, why do you shoot film? <laughs> uh, I shoot film because it is generally a slower and more thoughtful process than a lot of the faster paced digital work that I do. I feel like in the end, I end up with a lot of images that I'm really proud of when I shoot a roll of film. Yeah. Now, what was your real, your real response? Tones! All right, Eric, why do you shoot film? Uh, Twitter club. <laughs> are you on Twitter right now? <laughs> what are you watching? What was that? Go back up. A corgi's walk, corgi's walk down, corgi's, corgi's walk downstairs. All right, Eric, why do you shoot film? I started shooting film five years ago when I wanted to document my personal life in a different way than digital. It was a much better starting off point aesthetically. I just liked the look way better from the start than trying to have to make my digital photos look like that. And now I use it as creative fuel for all my still imagery. All right, Liz, why do you shoot film? Um, I shoot film because it slows me down in the moment it makes me be more present because I'm not worried about getting the precise exact digital photo and I'll just get what I get. Bye. Hey Braxton, why do you shoot film? Well, it's 
really just the process of being able to manually do something with your hands. You really feel like you're making a photo. <laughs> just like my friends mentioned, I echo all of their thoughts. For all the reasons that they mentioned are the same exact reasons why I shoot film. I really have fallen in love with the medium and it's been closing in on like a year and a half, almost two years of shooting it more seriously. And it's been revolutionary, not only for my business, but for my personal life and the way that I document my family and my kids. And in, in a lot of ways, it's also expanded my creativity. It's changed the way that I perceive the world around me, how I document it. And again, I fully echo all the sentiments that my friends mentioned. As I've kind of deep dived into this topic, it also led me to this one question of, will the popularity of film photography, will the bubble burst eventually? And I think the short answer is yes. I think like a lot of trends and fads, they come and go. And this is a trend that's not only again seen in the photography space, but high schoolers, Gen Z, millennials, a lot of people are shooting film right now. We're seeing it in the celebrity, space we're seeing it in just like regular people shooting film i think what will largely dictate how long this will be popular is going to be the price of film currently film is expensive and it's gotten more expensive over the course of the past two years and i don't see it slowing down anytime soon so i do think that that'll be a barrier for a lot of people to maybe eventually stop shooting film is going to be the cost of not only shooting but developing and scanning as well so there's just a lot involved with shooting film but i am curious six months from now a year from now will film photography as far as the popularity slow down i guess time will tell i hope it doesn't i think it's great for artists i think it's great for just normal people to document their lives and just slow down a little bit in a world that's so fast appreciate you guys would love a like and subscribe if you have questions on film photography i'd be more than happy to answer them in the comments so leave a question there and i'll see you in the next one bye